I'm Paul Ozinga. I'm uh, Executive Vice President of Ozinga Ready Mix Chicago Division. Ozinga is a family owned and operated company. We've been around since 1928. I'm Todd Zima. I'm a design principal at Studio Gang and what I do here is oversee a bunch of projects and I work to make sure the design of each project is fulfilled. There's a big issue in the city of Chicago with, with runoff flowing into the sewer system causing a watershed problem. A few years back, uh, the city of Chicago set out to build a number of boat houses and we worked with Studio Gang on incorporating pervious concrete into the design. We've been interested in materiality in general for a long time and concrete is one of the materials that's really been giving us a lot of uh, design ideas and a lot of ways to interpret buildings and we're seeing a lot more permeable material being put down to deal with large areas of, of uh, paving that typically take on water and charge the sewer but can are really not seen and they can easily uh, let water pass through. A group of us went down to Ozinga and did a, a basically a training course. They came over, did some mock-ups, we did some live pours with them so they could see how it works, how it looked. So we studied different strength blends and different um, ways to put this kind of material together. We were able to design pervious Ozinga filter creek to be able to deal with the runoff. It's very environmentally friendly. It's, if there is any pollution on the surface, that stuff washes through and there's microbes and uh, fungi that are in the pervious concrete and in the stone below that actually break that down. What was important to the Park District is that you install applications like this in ways that are going to last. Permeable concrete is one that really allows you to do a lot um, in places that need a durable surface. Ozinga is continuously trying to improve its products, update its products, as well as coming up with new designs. And we're always looking at new opportunities to incorporate recycled material so you can meet a smaller footprint and things like that.